All right, ladies and gentlemen, Fab's in the house. And today I've got the Leatherman Wave Plus here with me. Uh, today we're gonna do just a quick overview of the tools of this guy. Um, so, but let's do just a quick size comparison. This is up against the Bigger Brother Leatherman Surge and just like uh, the Free P2 over here. So very comparable in size. And also you have here your uh, Leatherman Free T4 right over here to just to show you how uh, big this guy is. So let's just do a quick uh, overview for the tools. Like let's start from this side. Yeah, here you have your main blade. Uh, nice, nice point over here, nice drop point. Um, you see it's like nicely chamfered uh, on the spine. You have a nice thumble, uh, you know, plain edge up, up to here and then, you know, nice belly, you know, uh, it's 420 HC, so high carbon steel. So yeah, pretty much good to go. Um, Next to that, you have your um, diamond um, file, you see, and saw, metal saw right over here. So pretty interesting and thick stock. Uh, also very, very useful. And then up next, you have your serrated blade. So this is, uh, this is gonna shred uh, and go and cut through like, a, you know, plastic and synthetic material like, like a boss. And also you have this kind of like reverse tanto tip, which is gonna be use useful to, if you need to scrape uh, some materials. Also opening uh, mechanism is gonna be done through the thumb all. Uh, right next to that, you got your wood saw, which has like pretty sharp teeth right over here. Very, very functional and useful. So uh, on the outside also you have like a deep carry uh, pocket clip, which is an optional uh, and it's just removable. So like this, you just twist it to the side and you take it out. Um, then you can open the tool and see you have your needle nose pliers with your hard wire cutter tabs inserts which are replaceable so nice addition compared to the leatherman wave like the previous generation so you can cut the the wires here you have like a, a wire crimper down here and uh, yeah very very it's very interesting on this side you've got your uh, uh, your bits which are, you know, like the Letterman bits. They're not the classic uh, hex uh, uh, bits you can easily find. You're gonna have to get, uh, you know, some specific ones for, for this one. And they, are, they look like they come in like packages like this. So they have this shape and you have quite, pretty much uh, some, uh, some different options. Uh, of course, it's reversible, so you have two uh, bits per bit. And then next to this one, you're gonna have your uh, wire stripper, uh, can opener, and bottle opener as well, right over there. Uh, so you go to the other side, and you have your like pry bar or like medium size uh, flathead screwdriver with a pretty uh, thick stock over here. And next to that, uh, you have your eyeglasses um, micro screwdriver, which has a flat head on this side. You can rotate it to the other side and you're gonna have like a Phillips head screwdriver right over here. Uh, and then next to that, you have your scissors, which are foldable like that. So you have to fold them like this in order to put them back and to deploy, you have to rotate this side over here. So very interesting. They're quite tiny. Stock th uh, thickness is pretty uh, thin, I have to say. Then there is like a hidden tool, which is like this guy over here. It's a lanyard, which is pretty hard to, to get out. This is a new one, so it's it's not gonna come out easily, but there's a hidden lanyard right over here. You can pull it out and you're gonna have just a little lanyard hole right over there to help you if you're a la uh, lanyard guy. So there you have it. This was my quick uh, overview uh, for the Leatherman Wave Plus. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.